Hello, and welcome back to my Ultima 4 Quest of the Avatar series. We are here in level six of the Abyss, right where we left off. Let's take a quick peek. Uh, this is the level we are on. We are actually standing right here, just in front of this door that's heading uh, eastward. We're going to go through these two combat rooms and get to the next onk, uh, or, or altar, I should say. Uh, and go down to level seven. So we'll see how what the combat rooms have for us, what their particular design aesthetics gonna be. I feel like we're doing a MTV Cribs of the Abyss. Let's see what we got. Boy, we have got headless like in our faces. I'm not quite sure what to make of the the uh, the blackness there. It's kind of weird. Are we supposed to be? willing to attempt to walk on that it doesn't make a lot of sense all right taking care of taking out a couple of them i mean we've fought headless before we know exactly what we have to fear and the answer is really not much because they're fairly easy enemies Right. Doesn't help when you keep missing. But we've got two left, one left, zero left. Okay, so I'm guessing that these two black areas here are going to be places that we can cross I'm making that assumption I don't know if I'm making a mistake I can't go there okay so I think there's a bit of a maze here and, and we can't see Because I tried to go left. I didn't try to go down there. I should move Viola back. Well, I'll come down. So somewhere there's a path. Iolo can't go down. Shamino can't go down. All right, now I'm confused. Because we can't go anywhere. How are we supposed to cross? Hmm. Did we need some of the headless to to cross there somehow? Do we need to like leave and come back in and try to force some of the headless to come down here and step on one of these places? I'm not really sure how that would work. Let's see if there's if there are a particular member of our I especially want to try like Katrina there who's got no magic she can't do anything I'm assuming we can't walk across the water can't walk those bricks or not we can't yeah we can't walk across the water does it say blocked it does say blocked All right, let's let's treat this like, um, you know, we need to find a button. This might just be another, but I mean, this is a really small space, and now I think we've touched every tile. here I have one idea I want to try just for chuckles I'm going to cast an energy field um, I don't know let's do let's do fire direction that way 
failed. Okay, so I couldn't put it there. Okay, I was hoping if I could put a put an energy field there and then dispel it, that might work. Hmm. 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 Are there any other grand? I mean, I don't think an open spell would do me any good here because there's nothing to open. I suppose I could try. Maybe I'll try that next. Try an open spell. Yeah, there's nothing to open. Yeah, I, I, I think I think the play, and I don't understand necessarily how we're going to do it, is to get one of the headless to back up. And I think the way I want to do that, it's going to be tough. Um, let's see. So you can go. You can go. You can go. Now you, Joffrey. So what I'm going to use is I'm going to use Joffrey. And I might do it myself. So I'm going to ready a weapon for Joffrey, and he's going to use his hands. And I'm going to ready a weapon for Katrina, and she's going to use her hands. None left? What? Did I, I, I probably did that wrong. It's probably like A or something for hands and not H. All right, you can come down, you can come up. I wanted to ready a weapon for her. What I'm thinking is, because right now our weapons are too powerful for headless, and I think that's part of the, yes, it's A for hands. Uh, and I think that's part of the challenge. All right, so uh, we get done with this, and then we'll, we'll ready um, some real weapons again. But what I think we need to do is we need to get some of them to flee. So really, it's probably down to Joffrey, as far as that goes, the way this thing is laid out. And everybody else, I'm not going to have them attack. I think we can, we're doing good on health. Everybody's at full health. It doesn't help that we're missing. That's kind of annoying. Can we not hit these guys with our hands? Oh my freaking God. Really? We haven't done one hit here. Why are we missing everything now? Okay, so I think here's what I'm going to try. Um... All right, I'm going to cast Tremor. We'll lose some, but hopefully some of them will flee. That's supposed to be the case. You're going the wrong direction, dude. And let's see if we get these guys to flee. Let's see if we can get one. We can herd one. You stay put. You come over in the right direction. That's what I want to have happened. So, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Missed. This guy doesn't seem to be... This guy doesn't seem to be... Fleeing. Let's see. So I wish we could actually land a hit on these guys. Whoops, whoops. I'm um, just got hands right now. And I don't know if it's because there's supposedly a thing about we can only use magic stuff to hit the things. I remember reading that at some point here in the abyss. And I guess that also relates to our hands. 
because we aren't hitting squat. These guys are not. These guys aren't hitting us either, for, as far as that goes. I was really hoping. I don't want to do another tremor because I'll probably kill these three and then we're right where we left off. All right, so let's move you over there. Let's move you over there. And we're just going to try to herd these guys as much as I can. Trouble is, uh, yeah, that's the trouble. Okay, so. This one guy seems to be on the move. But uh, Katrina's in his way. What happens? I keep wanting to move Julia back so I can move Katrina in and I keep messing up. I'm just wishing if we could hit it. Well, I guess I was going to say hit it one time on the jaw, but being a headless. <laughs> for not hitting it on the jaw. This is the weirdest battle I've ever been in. Alright. Come on, dudes. Let's do a little juking and jiving here. It's weird that they're not hitting us. I mean, we're all still at full health. Which is weird. I mean, is the challenge to not... Not hurt any of them? Maybe they'll roam more if we aren't killing them? All it takes is one guy when the when the area is full to step backwards. Unfortunately, I don't have a spell that just sows fear. That would actually be kind of nice if you just could make them flee, but I don't have anything. You know, there's a jinx spell, but that also tends to kill some of them. Um and I don't have any other spell that is going to make them flee. I'm just going to sit here and um, see if they'll move over time. All right, I'm going to try something here. I'm going to try, because I got the flame and oil. So I'm curious now. I missed. I did not miss. He just took damage. Did you hear that? So my hope is that he's going to take... How did that guy die? That's not the guy I put flame and oil on. The, the tile is not red. I want this guy to take enough damage that he'll start fleeing. Ah, oh, crap. They all died. <laughs> That wasn't what I wanted. Oh, we still have one alive. Okay, I was thinking we're done. But we still have one alive. Um, all right, so the flame and oil thing obviously is not going to work. The, the don't hit it with things is obviously not going to work. I don't want to do flaming oils on that.
Okay, now he's fleeing. Nobody do anything else. There we go. Be gone with ye. We will allow thee to flee. No, don't flee back at us, you moron. Flee the other direction. I thought you were fleeing. Come on, I don't want to hit you again. We're going to kill you. <laughs> Come on, keep going. Unless he can't keep going. I think he's blocked too. Yeah, I think he's blocked too. Actually, what I need to do next time he moves over, yes, here, I need Iolo or yeah, one of those two. So now he's blocked in. He can only if he if he can move, he can only go toward the east. But I'm not certain he can move. All right, we got to back out again. I think. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what the uh, secret here is. Yeah, I don't know what the secret is. Now, what happens if I stand here and if I do an attack of flaming oil that way for a range of one, then it's missed. It missed, but it didn't because I'm getting hit when I try to go there. Oh, because... It, it bounced off and is on my spot. I see. All right. Hmm. I'm confused. Let's see. So let's go back to the map for a second. I'm kind of wondering if I need to learn something or if I need to like go in from the top. Oh, maybe I need to go in from the top because you could go out the top or the side. Now the top doesn't make much sense. I bet this is some sort of mazy kind of thing here. Oh, wow. So where do I enter this? I wonder, do I enter, just enter it here? Or do I try to enter it? Let's try for the quickest route, which would just be doing a quick U and then to there. And then we'll see where this is going to take us. I bet that's what we got to do. All right. So, so let's just, let's just pop up in here. All right. There's nothing we can do here. We can't get across, but we can see there's a path there. So there's a, we got to find the right path for this thing. So we're just going to back out because that's really the only thing we can do. Because these rock walls, I, we've never seen a rock wall that can change, you know? So I'm not... So let's go up to this one. Oop. I lost my light. Okay, so next door over. We we're just in that one. We come up here and we could take this little snaky path to get around the corner, basically. But that seems kind of wasteful. So we're just going to back up out of here. I, oh, Balron. Crap. Um, I think you can cast in the gate. It seems kind of worthless, but we've got two Balrons in the room and they can really make our life a living heck. All right, you two get out of here. And 
they can't get me, and I'm just going to kind of wait for my people to wake up. All right. All right, everybody's awake. Perfect. So then we can back out of here. <laughs> uh, stinking barons. <laughs> Okay, so we're not going to go in there again because that's leading to the Balron room. Let's go in here. So this will take us north out of here, which we could do. That would lead us to the, there's a secret uh, door there. But I, I, once again, I think it's easier just to back up out of here and we'll take the secret door. And we know when we go in the secret door, we, we just want to go east. So, so let's back up. Whoops, wrong way. That's not back up. I did down and instead of come over, you can go out. Whoops. All right. Who the heck are you shooting at? The other the other sea serpent? All right. So here we are. There is a secret door here. Yes, there is. Actually, let's while we're while we're in the secret door, um, let's pop it our notes. So we are at the secret door right here. So we basically have checked this room and this room and this room, and now we've got to go into this room and come over to here. And we're just gonna have to try to find the path that's gonna lead us to this room, which would then we could then get down. And and we could go through it to get into this room. That's that's basically what's got to happen here, I think. I probably should have been taking screenshots of all these rooms just so that I could really put the path together, but I did not. So we'll just have to make do here as best we can. So I definitely want to leave this going to the east. So that's going to take us back south. Not what we want. That takes us back into the room with the Balrons. And we can see we got that northern pass. So we've got to go around the corner again and enter through that, that middle door on the northern edge of the square, if you will. So we're just going to back up. Which means I think there's a whole path here that's just nothing. All right, so we're gonna back up. I'm trying, I'm, I'm facing west. Oh, I just wanna go straight. All right, so now, probably gonna have to, I don't know, they're kinda walking away from us, that's fine. So now we're gonna enter this room. Yeah, 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 this is what we want. Actually, I didn't really wanna do that. I'm gonna come down here. All right, you come over. You come down. You come down. You come over. You wait. You come down. You come over. I'm gonna wait. And I'm gonna get all my people out of here ahead of me. We're not gonna make Julia go down last this time. She gets to be in the middle of the parade. All right. Okay, here we go. So, well, we know we don't want to go north because that's just going to dump us back into the hallway. Um, well, actually, let's go back to the notes real fast. So we are in this room here. And if we go north, it's going to dump us back into the hallway. If we go, if we go across, we're going to end up in this hallway, which means where we need to go is in here. Yeah, we got to go in here. So we're just going to, once again, we are going to back up. And then we're going to go over there to that door. So... And I'm not worried about these Nixies. Who cares about these Nixies? Not me. That's who. 
We could kill you, but why do we want to bother? Oh, oh, that's right. We're in here. Oh, gosh. Yeah, all right. So this is a bit more involved than I thought. We could have gone straight across and just, you know, fought the next season, gotten out of there, I guess. I, I was, yeah, I had a brain fart there. That's my bad. Whatever, we'll just, we'll just work our way through this little, little windy bit here and get back to the hallway. Okay, so we want to face east. We're going to have to take on these gremlins, I guess. Oh, yeah, all of these gremlins. There we go. 94 gold, nice. All right, so we want to go into this. Well, I want to check out this one. I'm not certain about this one. It might be the same as on the other side. All right, so I'm going to cast in the gate. There's no way out of here either. I mean, if we could get to where either of the ball runs to the side are at, I'm just going to... We could do a dispel on those energy shields, but I'm... Yeah, it's this rock. I'll just get rid of this demon because he's in my face. We gotta go back. Alright. Everybody back up. This is starting to frustrate me. I guess... I guess I need to take better care of the path. What we're going to do is, now that we're out of here, we're going to check in here. All right. We're wasting a lot of negate spells here. Interesting, it failed. Is that because there was already a negate spell here? Now, this is interesting because... If we can get in here, we could dispel our way through and get down to the south, which is where where we would want to be. But we would have to find a way to get in here. And because if I pop back to my notes real fast, we are in this room. So, but I don't, we could, what we couldn't find was the way into this room. Because we came in here. Wow, okay, I'm going to have to think about this. I'm going to have to think about this a little bit, I think. All right, so let's... Um, let's back up before the negates... Well, there's a negate spell in place. Maybe, maybe it was already in place, still in effect... From the, from the other room with the Balrons. And that's where my negate failed. Oh, there we go. Apparently now I, I'm guessing that's what happened. That's why. So let's get out of here. Okay. <laughs> that's been a lot of gameplay. And I really haven't got anywhere. We've looked at all these rooms. Let's go back to the map one last time. I think what I'm going to have to do is like thoroughly map this out, you know, take a, go ahead and grab a screenshot and put it in something like this. And there must be a path I missed. We have not made it to the center room and maybe that's the important thing, but I don't think we had a path to the center room. So I'm not quite sure how that, how we would get to the center room. So yeah, I'm, I'm a little confused, you know, that's nothing new, but, uh, yeah, I thought we were just going to, you know, plow through a few of these combat rooms and find ourselves on level seven. And here we are. I've basically recorded 40 minutes here. <laughs>
we're still on level six and we haven't made it to the altar to get down to level seven. Oh my god welcome to the abyss man anyway uh <laughs> sad to say i'm gonna have to let that be that for this one uh i will be back uh with another episode soon and uh i hope you'll join me for that one where hopefully we will have a lot more things happen that will move us forward in this quest but until then be seeing you <laughs>